Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a small little uh, fire extinguisher that you can use just to keep handy when you're having like a bonfire or whatever where there's going to be a fire hazard and you just want to be safe. So to start off, some of the things you're going to need are some baking soda and maybe a little spoon to get it out with. Um, I use a measuring spoon, but the measurements don't need to be too exact. Um, some vinegar. All I have is apple cider vinegar, but that should work just as fine. A uh, pretty decent sized bottle with a top. And uh, I'm going to use a lighter, and you're going to either need a lighter or a, uh, a drill to get a hole in this top. And then a uh, paper towel. And if, you, uh, if your paper towel is pretty thick, you might want to uh, split the two layers in half, which is what I'm going to do. So you just get one edge and then uh, just rip it in half like this. So, And we won't need the whole thing, so we'll just get about that much. Alright, we got that. So the first thing I'm going to do is I set these aside. Alright, you're going to take your baking soda and get a little bit out. Actually, we'll tear this off first. Get about half of the paper towel. That looks good. And uh, well, Alright. Start with a little bit and just kind of eyeball it just to see how much you need. I want to fill it up pretty good. So that looks like enough and then what we're going to do is fold it together and um, fold the ends up and just twist it so it stays together. Alright now the next thing we're going to do is take your water bottle and you want to start filling it up with vinegar and you don't need too much Say about that much vinegar, and then we're gonna add some just some regular water and dish soap to it. Just a little, maybe like half a squirt of dish soap at the most, and just mix those in there pretty good. All right, so now we got that, maybe about that much water. So now for the top, you're going to take your lighter and or the drill. If you have a drill, just drill a hole, maybe the uh, just barely big enough to fit the end of this through. You want it to stay pretty tight in there so it doesn't fall out unless you are ready for it to. But just melt the top and then pretty quickly get your bamboo skewer. Stick it in there. Alright, we got it through. Now let's make the hole a little bit bigger. Just wiggle it through. Maybe light it one more time just so we can uh, widen out this hole. And, you know, just test it with your napkin and uh, just see what's good for you. Just make sure the uh, the napkin will stay in tight, but it'll come out when you need it to. Because that's how this is going to work. We're going to have it all top on and the napkin with the baking soda in it inside. And so when you want to uh, like get the fire extinguisher ready, you'll just push down the napkin into the hole. And it'll uh, react with the baking soda, or with the vinegar. And uh, it'll, shoot all, it'll all shoot out of this little nozzle and whatever you need to put out. Alright, so that should be enough. And now um, we'll put this together and I'll show you what it uh, looks like. Alright, so we got the napkin in this top now. And uh, the top screwed on tight. So this is live, so you got to be careful now. Don't shake this unless you're ready to use it because it will start the reaction and uh, start spraying all the water out. But um, I'll take it outside and uh, show you how it works. Alright guys, I'm back outside now. Sorry I don't have a real fire, but um, it works just the same. So uh, what you want to do is uh, grab the little piece of napkin on top, push it down back into the bottle. Mine was a little hard, so I needed a stick. There we go. And shake it. And just spray out the fire. And there you go. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see my future videos. See ya.